And some final shots. Uh, that looks like a looks like a, a, a pintail. And ooh, that's a that's a widgeon over there. And there's another pintail. And these must be hybrids over here. And this is the duckery. Where ducks can be, uh, the, the ducklings can be raised. They've got protective netting over the top so that they can't be predated. And uh, that's very good. And they're all in their uh, winter plumage. Uh, white faced whistling duck. That's him over there, I would say. Preening himself. Like a golden eye or two in there. I don't know. I'm not very good at identifying these things. Ah, there's, there's a golden eye. So if you can't identify your duck, come here to Castle Lesby and, uh, and it's a good way of, uh, of learning and, and being able to, to identify the ducks. And there's the man himself, uh, Sir Peter Scott with his binoculars. I think that's an excellent uh, sculptor. Uh, Sir Peter Scott, painter, naturalist, uh, founder of Wildlife Trust 1946. And his wife, his lady wife, uh, opened this centre in 1990. So it's uh, goodbye from Castle Espy for today. Um, and, uh, nest boxes about the place to keep the birds uh, happy. <laughs>